Hey everyone, Coach Dave here. Coach Eddie. We're on episode 13 and today we're going to be talking about ankles. Yes. Um, and specifically probably the bottom of the foot and how the foot relates to squatting mechanics. We've talked about this before, but why does it affect the knee? Yeah, yeah so we've covered the ankle before, we've covered the knee, but we're kind of just going back now and going over with what we th might think might be an important idea to cover and you know why the ankle is so important and why it's so over missed in yeah, crossfit especially the bottom of the foot so a lot of people are dealing yeah. with plantar fasciitis we know that uh, running season's coming to an end and i know a few athletes in the gym who are complaining of either a little bit of a knee pain on the outside yeah. of the knee um, and it's actually related to a spot that's right by the baby toe uh, and then also plantar fasciitis Yep. which is basically a base hardening of the arch of yeah, the foot, yeah, which the tendon that runs to the bottom can of the foot. cause some problems for your Achilles. So here we go. We're going to get into it. All right. Guys, so we're going to talk about your Achilles health, how you can maintain that, because um, you don't want to have a ruptured Achilles. And if that's not moving properly, your ankles aren't going to be moving properly. We're going to have some foot problems, okay? And then we're going to talk about how to mash out the fascia on the bottom of your foot, and specifically the spot right in front of that baby toe which is gonna have a nerve and a tendon that runs all the way up here. So if you're having problems with the knee, I've had a few of you point like, I have this problem with my knee right here when I'm running. It's related to the spot that's right below that baby toe. So lacrosse ball, you're gonna put it on the ground. And when you're gonna basically, you wanna think about pressing down into the, the, the foot, okay? So a lot of us kind of baby this and we're just kind of rolling the foot over. No, you really have to press down into that, really put some weight into it. And that's gonna be at the baby toe right by the ball of the foot. Once you get in there, you're gonna go side to side, okay? Don't just sit in it. I'm hitting that spot, but I wanna go side to side and break up all the adhesions and fashion there, okay? For the front of the heel, same thing. Put it down by the front of the heel, press down into it, and saw back and forth to break up some of those adhesions, okay? And now we're gonna get into the Achilles tendon. You're just gonna lay down on the ground. You're gonna think about kind of giving yourself an Indian burn, but basically you're gonna put both fingers on the back of that Achilles. And then you're gonna flex the toe towards you. So I'm really grabbing that my my foot and really wrapping those hands on that Achilles, so pressing it in. And then I'm gonna push up toward the ceiling and then back down. So I'm allowing that to move freely. I'm just breaking up stuff, and I'll do that on both sides. Okay, so really have a firm grasp on that Achilles tendon. Allow that to move, because that's what we should have, full range of motion. All right, guys, I'm gonna be focusing on the calf and the Achilles tendon as well. Um, now you can place the voodoo floss all the way down from you know the Achilles tendon all the way up to the top of the calf, depending on the area that you're focusing on more, but you want the area that you're working on covered by the voodoo floss itself. And what I'll do then is I'll take this leg and I'll cross my other foot over and I'll use my shin it's kind of a self-mashing tool as I saw back and forth up and down the entire calf itself. So I'll start low and I'll work my way up all the way towards the knee. And then if I want more pressure, I just sit back further and move my knee back and forth, working all the way up. I'm kind of spending a decent amount of time on that area. You know, this will also help loosen up the shins on the other side, but it's really focusing on the calf on the side with the voodoo floss on it. All right, guys, that is a wrap on episode 13 where we covered the ankle and the bottom of your foot, specifically that fascia on the Achilles tendon. Thanks for joining us, guys. And remember, optimize your body. Optimize your potential. And optimize your life. We'll see you guys next time on Wad Science. Take care, guys.